So I'm just going to close the browser. And if you recall, the default routes for our application are being set to the index action on the home controller. So that's where our sort of home page is. So what we're going to do is we're going to go up into the web project. And before that, I'm just going to go ahead and make some commits. And before we make any edits there, I'm going to go ahead and make a commit. Okay, so now down in our controllers here, we have a home controller. And the first thing I'll do is just clean up usings as usual here. And what I'd like to do is just like the rest of the views in our system is to create a view model for our home page as well. So what I can do is specify a new model and we'll have a method for it that we'll call build home index model. That way we'll keep our controller action nice and, uh, nice and lightweight here and we're going to pass the view this model. So we'll control period here on build home index model. It's going to create a private method and we're going to assign it a type home index model and then in our models directory we'll go ahead and build that. So create a new folder, call it home and then in here we'll add a class home index model and what I'd like to be able to do from the, the home page is two things. One, we'll have a collection. So we'll bring collections in. We'll have a collection of our post listing model. So control create also to bring that in. And we'll call those latest posts. So the home page won't be you know assigned to a particular forum topic. Oops. Um, but it will be a place where we can show all the latest posts for any of the forums. And I'd also like to have sort of global search functionality. So we'll create this search query property that we'll implement in a little while. Um, but from the home page, we'd like to be able to search our entire forum database. Um, for posts corresponding to this particular query. So this, as you can see, will actually lead us into building out the search functionality for our application, which is a pretty interesting part. So back in the home controller, we'll control period here to bring in the home index model. And now that we have, some, have started to build some of the main view models out for our system, we have more and more available to us and the various controller methods that we create um, start to move a little bit more quickly. So what I'm going to do is control period on home controller and we're going to create a constructor and a private field to store a post service. Alright, so let's go ahead and grab a collection of those post listing models. And we'll get latest posts from our post service, which is a method we'll have to write. So um, let's go ahead and we'll say it'll take an int and we can just grab the 10 latest posts. So I'll control period here. So it's going to generate it in our interface. And so if we hit F12, we can visit that. And this will be an I enumerable posts. And I'll move it up here. And yeah, we can say like number of posts. Or maybe just N. Okay. All right, so now if we head over into our post service and to the top, we can control period to implement that new member of this interface. And then we'll go find the method here, get latest posts. And what we can do is we can simply call the get all method. And then we'll use the link to order by descending on the created date. So we'll say post.created. And then we'll use take just to take the n number of posts that we want to return. So we can just return it just like that. Okay, so back in our controller. So we have 10 of our latest posts back from our database. 
and now we can push those into the post listing model that this home index model is expecting. So we can say latest and we can map those using the select operator. So we can bring in link. And we'll just go ahead and assign all the properties. In fact, we need to make sure we bring in this model as well. Oops, so the author name here and then yeah date posted and we can call it to string here and so just as before we'll need to build out a forum here similar to the collection of the post listing models that we had on the topic action of our forum controller. So we use a forum service. And then for the forum, we'll actually need to write a method to build out a forum listing model based on this uh, post. So let's go ahead and just do it this way. And we'll say maybe get form listing for post. And we also have this replies count that we can just say post.replies.count on. Okay, so let's go ahead and build this control period. And we'll come down here. And the way this is going to work is that we have a post. And now we just need to get the post forum and push that forum into a forum listing object. So we'll return a new forum listing model. And we'll say that the forum is equal to the post forum. And we'll just go ahead and set all the properties that we need here. We have the forum name. Maybe we'll use the image URL. The ID. And maybe that's all we really need to show on the home page in terms of what forum everything was posted to. All right, so we have a, the ability to get all of this data. Um, we pass it into this post listing model. And now to complete our build home index model method, we just simply return a new home index model. And we set latest posts equal to posts. Oops, it looks like we're getting some type of error here on our get forum listing for post. Ah, and no, that's just because I accidentally put a semicolon here inside of the return. Okay, so that looks pretty good. The only other property we have on here is the search query, I believe. So um, for now, we'll just set that to an empty string. Um, but this is just more or less to remind us that it's here. And so we'll scroll up a little bit here. And so now when we hit our home index action, we're actually going to build out a home index model and return it to the view. And that home index model is going to contain a collection of 10 of the latest posts, which are available across our entire database. Um, so this posts are simply getting all the posts, ordering them by, in descending order by the, the date they were created on, and then taking that number of them. Okay, so we push those into a post listing model and provide that back to our home index model.